It's Ben McPherson, come on, everyone stop clapping. Come on. This guy says stop. <laughs> okay, yes, hello. Hello, how are we all? How are we all? Good. Good, thank you. Yes, there we go. That's the response I wanted, because it'd be, it'd be awkward if I was talking to you and you weren't happy. Because, you know, you can be miserable by the end of this. Um, yes. So, uh, this this is my 12th, 12th or 13th gig now, and I'm, I'm starting to get professional now. Uh, I've learned all the terminology. You've got microphone. That's the thing that you're talking to. <laughs> you've, uh, you've, got, you've got your set, which is the words of what you say to people. Uh, and then you've got a heckler which is an Icelandic volcano. <laughs> thank you, thank you. We're, we're, we're just, you, have to, you have to think when I talk, because um, I don't make a lot of sense otherwise. Um, yes, so uh, relationships is what I'd like to start talking to you about, says he, remembering his prompts, which is written on his hand in case of emergencies. Um, yes, but uh, I, I'm currently not in a relationship. And I know that will astound many of you, because I'm, I'm just so sexy. Uh, but uh, I, I do, I do want, I do want a girlfriend. Um, in actual fact, I am currently recruiting, and anyone who would want to apply for this or, or any position, really, please do give me your CV at the end. Um, all, all applicants will be considered. Maybe not you. <laughs> Don't, don't. Ruin my Sunday. <laughs> I'm about to ruin everyone else's. Don't <laughs> um, yes, uh, but but I have friends in relationships, and uh, this irritates me because they're happy, and I could handle it if they if they were in a relationship and miserable, or or miserable. And, and well, I've already said that. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I haven't even had any alcohol. It's the J2O. It's getting to me. Um, it's going wild. Um, yes, uh, but um, uh, I have. Uh, I do want a relationship, and I'm, I'm looking for certain, certain. I think reasonable traits in, in a woman. Uh, first, first of all, they have to be intelligent. I, I couldn't stand someone who didn't understand a word I said, because I can hardly understand what I say. And I think in a relationship, someone should actually be able to understand what on earth the other person is saying. And uh, the other the other factor I'm looking for is, is stunning good looks. No, really, really, what I'm looking for is a female version of me. <laughs> um, yes, but uh, I've, I've got a friend who keeps uh, trying to set me up with people. And uh, we were at the pod the other day. And he said to me, "Hey man, hey man," because because he's street and cool like that. Hey man, um, I, I found the perfect girl for you. She, she's pretty. She's funny. Uh, she, she's a lesbian and she plays the bassoon. What? She, uh, she's a lesbian, but she, she's sort of bi, really. No, that wasn't the problem. Have you ever heard the bassoon being played? It's awful. <laughs> but um, is anyone in here married? You. Yeah. Thank you, Dad. Um, <laughs> okay. The links are all there. The links are all there. Um, yes, and uh, of course, marriage, marriage you mark with, uh, with anniversaries. And you also match. Um, you know, proper relationships, you know, ones where you're actually happy with um, anniversaries. But uh, marriage is the one where you've got themed anniversaries. And and for the first the first ten years, you have one sort of you know you've got year one, year two, year three. You know, you know how numbers work. And um, <laughs> and then then suddenly at, at, at ten it stops, and you've got them every sort of five years, then ten years, and then rather than sort of I will love you forever, it's sort of oh you still here. I thought you'd gone home. Fine. Um, but of course, of course, they're themed, aren't they? They're themed after uh, when you're married. And uh, your your first anniversary is your paper anniversary, and that's romantic, isn't it? <laughs> Darling, we have been married a whole year, and in accordance with tradition. I don't know why he's sort of a wizard. <laughs> <laughs> and in accordance with tradition, I have brought you this. Darling, what is it? It is a refill pad. <laughs> but this is not just any refill pad. This is a wide rule. 100 leaves. 
80 GSM refill pad. Darling, it's fantastic. It's exactly what I wanted. And I only got your toilet paper. <laughs> Toilet humor. There we go. Um, <laughs> um, yes, and then of course you you could have uh, a themed activities, couldn't you? You know. And now, my love, we will now have our paper themed anniversary. We are going to go on holiday on a paper plane. <laughs> and we're going to take an origami class, unless the company folds. <laughs> Puns. Woohoo! Uh, yes. Um, yes, but as I say, I am not in a relationship, and so I sort of resort to what any uh, what any male does and does chores instead. 